There are two main methods to get the hundreds of layers you want on your puff pastry. Full puff pastry is made by flattening a block of butter and locking it in between layers of dough. Roll and fold the dough several times to get thin, even sheets of butter that separate each layer. After just two folds, the layers of butter and dough are still thick and easily separated. Once you get to four or even up to six folds, the dough has hundreds of crispy layers. For rough puff pastry, the butter is first cut into cubes and incorporated into the dough before rolling and folding the same as before. You still need to chill the dough after each pair of folds to keep the butter cold and prevent it from melting into the dough, but there's slightly less to worry about compared to the process for full puff. You're still creating thin layers of butter in the dough, but they won't be as distinct as the ones in full puff. If you're intimidated by full puff pastry though, I recommend trying rough puff, and with four to six folds, you can get an amazing flaky pastry.